Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we are going to solve and check this exponential equation 7 power a minus 7 minus 7 power b minus 7 equals to 2400. In other words, we are going to find the value of a and b. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Let's go ahead and get started with the solution and here's the very first thing we can see. We can see we got 7 power negative 7 and then 7 power negative 7 as well. So therefore we are going to manipulate this equation by multiplying by 7 power 7 across the board. So therefore let me write down 7 power 7 times this 7 power a minus 7 minus 7 power 7 times 7 power b minus 7 equal to 7 power 7 times 2400 on the right hand side. And now let's recall this product rule of exponents. We are going to apply it on the left hand side. So this could be written as 7 power 7 plus a minus 7 and then minus 7 power 7 plus b minus 7 equals to 7 power 7 times 2400. And now we can see on the left hand side this uh, positive 7 and negative 7 they are gone. Likewise this 7 minus 7 they cancel each other out. Therefore we are ended up on the left hand side at 7 power a minus 7 power b equals to 7 power 7 times 2400. Now let's focus on this right hand side this 7 power 7 times 2400. This is a number which is greater than 0. That means positive number. So therefore we conclude that this 7 power a minus 7 power b is greater than 0 or the other words 7 power a is greater than 7 power b. If that is the case then we can conclude that a is greater than b and now to make our job easier let's go ahead and do the substitution let me go ahead and write down a equals to b plus k where this k is an integer so therefore our this equation is going to become after the substitution as 7 power b plus k and then minus 7 power b equal to 7 power 7 times 2400. And now let's recall this product rule once again. We are going to apply it on the left hand side this part. So this could be written as 7 power b times 7 power k minus 7 power b equal to 7 power 7 times 2400. And now we can see on the left hand side this 7 power b and this 7 power b they are in common. Therefore we are going to factor 7 power b outside and we are left with the 7 power k minus 1 equal to 7 power 7 times 2400 on the right hand side. And now let's go ahead and compare the both sides of this equation. We can see we can set this 7 power b and this 7 power 7 together and the other part this 7 power k minus 1 equal to 2400. So therefore we can write 7 power b equal to 7 power 7 and the other part is going to be 7 power k minus 1 equals to 
100. Now let's go ahead and look at this very first equation. We can see our bases on both sides are same. Therefore, we can equate their exponents as well. So therefore, we can write this could be written as b equals to 7. So therefore, we figured out our b value. Now let's focus on this equation. Let's move this negative 1 on the other side. So we got 7 power k equals to 2400 and this negative 1 become positive 1. So therefore, 7 power k equals to 2401. But just keep in your mind that 2401 is same as 7 power 4. So therefore we can write 7 power k equal to 7 power 4. And now we can see that our bases on both sides are same. So therefore we can equate our exponents as well. So therefore our k value turns out to be simply 4. But then we know that our a equals to b plus k where we did this substitution. Let's go ahead and plug in this b and k value in this equation. So our a becomes equal to b is 7 plus k is 4. So therefore our a value turns out to be 11. So thus we conclude that our a value is 11 and b value is 7. And here's our final step. Let's go ahead and check our answer for a equals to 11 and b equal to 7 by just plugging in those values in this equation. And here's our this equation. Let's go ahead and replace this a by 11 and b by 7 and we're going to see whether the left hand side is same as the right hand side. Let's go ahead and substitute those values. 7 power a is 11 minus 7 minus 7 power b is 7 minus 7. The question mark is is the left hand side is same as the right hand side. Now on the left hand side that's going to give us 7 power 4 minus 7 power 0 question mark is it equal to 2400. Now we know that 7 power 4 is 2401 minus 7 power 0 is 1 question mark is it equal to 2400. So therefore this is indeed a true statement. So therefore we conclude that a equals to 11 and b equal to 7 are our valid values. So thus our solution turns out to be a equals to 11 and b equal to 7. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.